Students at Rante School are celebrating recent wins at the inaugural Young Arias Awards, following their involvement in their very own radio station, Rante Radio. It's been a project that's been running since before I actually started working at the school and it's just, it's clearly something that the students really, really are passionate about and we've also had some students who have gone on to work in the industry and their love for radio and for media in general has kind of taken them to places like Salford and to BBC so um, yeah, it, it's, it's, some, it's a project that is really, really important to the students in the school. What was your kind of reaction when you first sort of uh, headed in here? It was really nice. Like last year we were in um, a media classroom. That was quite fun as well, but um, we could only do it like one week per, like for the whole year, but now we can do it all year round. And it's just, it looks, it's like a place for Round A Radio and it's just really nice. What's it like kind of putting together sort of a, a programme like this? What are some of the challenges you face there? Quite a few of the challenges we face are like coming up with original content. Cause obviously like you sort of talk um, about everything that's happening, but obviously there's only like a finite amount of things that are happening at one time. So you sort of start repeating yourself sometimes, but it's, yeah, it's really good fun. And um, you do find things to talk about and it is original content, yeah. What's been the best thing for you uh, sort of being involved in something like this, would you say? Um, learning things like, I, I do the stuff behind the desk, so learning all that is very fun and just making me feel better and more confident in myself, to be honest. Any on-air sort of mishaps or any kind of memorable moments you can let us into? <laughs> um, well, I struggled to read it at one point, so um, I couldn't pronounce, what, what was I to pronounce? I can't even remember what I was pronouncing. Rockin' Gibraltar. Rockin' Gibraltar, something yeah. like that, and I couldn't pronounce it, so I was just like on there, just froze, I was like, what am I meant to do? So then everyone was laughing, it kind of just joked off, and then the next song I played the same song once again, like that I'd played a minute before, and we're just thinking, it couldn't get much worse than that, so it was quite fun to, funny to be honest.